Hi, and welcome to another episode of Haltech Q&A, where we respond to the questions that you guys have been asking on our social media. Our first question today comes from BT. I have a VP Commodore with a fuel-injected 355 stroker. What ECU would you recommend? Well, BT, your Holden Commodore VP with your V8 355 cubic inch that came factory with fuel injection was actually equipped with a Delco series ECU. You're in luck because we make a Delco replacement unit called the Platinum Sport GM. So you just need to unplug your factory computer, plug in our Platinum Sport GM, hit the key, it'll start and run, then you're ready to tune. Our next question today comes from Dark Knight. Apart from an ECU, what other boxes would I need for an engine conversion? Well, it's a really good question because we do do a different range of boxes and each box is for a different purpose. So to get your engine up and running, you're gonna need your main ECU or engine control unit. If you wanna add extra things like a wideband O2 sensor, you would need one of our WB02 wideband controller boxes. If you wanted to add thermocouples, you would need our TCA thermocouple amplifier box. You might want to add a dash, or you might want to add an I.O., an input-output expander module. But all of these are built off the basis of your main ECU. So to do your engine conversion, the only ECU you actually need is the main box, your main engine control unit, which would be your Platinum Sport or your Elite Series ECU. And our last question today comes from Salman Ali. I'm wiring in my Elite 1500, but I've lost my wiring diagram. Do you have these online anywhere? Well, Ali, you're certainly in luck. Yes, we do. If you jump on our website, which is just www.haltech.com, up the top of the page there, you'll see a downloads button. Once you click on that, you'll go into our archive of all of our wiring diagrams and a bunch of vehicle specific stuff if you've got a plug-in ECU. So if you just jump on there, find the wiring diagram for yours, download it, and you'll be able to start wiring. Keep in mind, we've also got wiring diagrams for all of our previous products in the same section. Well, thanks very much for watching. As always, if you want one of your questions answered, don't forget to leave it in the comments below. My name's Scott, and I'll see you next time.